Okay. Just one moment, dear friends. Sister Mallory needs you to play for her exactly what she shows you. Members of the congregation, please forgive my interruption. Now, let's talk for just a quick moment. What's real interesting is that time you clearly gave them a staccato. But you know why I stopped you and why I said what I said, right? Maybe? Help her out, anybody? Why did I stop her that first time and say what I said? Did you give a very staccato? Sarah knows. Yeah, it was more like staccato. The first time? Yeah. Really? Hmm. Interesting. Because the second time, I thought she gave a pretty clear staccato, but then you still kind of played legato-ish for her. Didn't you? Yeah. Yeah, that's what you mean by marcato? Yeah. Weight and length? Stompingly? Well, that's kind of pizzante, more than marcato. Okay. I just thought it was interesting that you, you look different the second time. Your video will show you that. And then I knew Sarah had something up her sleeve from what you first did because she didn't really do what you showed her the second time because I think she had plans based on what she did the first time. Okay. Interesting, okay? What, what happens in here every semester is that we get sort of programmed like robots. We know it's staccato time. That's why Wednesday and Friday would be really interesting because we don't know what you're going to do. Otherwise, we get the 9 a.m. blues here and we get kind of programmed. We know it's staccato time. You can go up there and conduct legato with one toe and we'll still give staccato because we're sort of on autopilot, okay? So, uh, sorry to keep interrupting, I won't anymore. Take a good breath and go ahead from me. Characteristics of legato to it. It'll be interesting for you to watch your video, and then I'm sure Jerusha has some thoughts for you. Okay, thanks.